Okay guys, so I'm back in the uh, police interceptor sedan uh, for the series of videos that I'm doing. So um, a lot of people have asked me, I can open the door from the back. The passengers can open it. I'm sitting in the back as you can tell. Um, but the thing is, is that I can't control the window. And that's really simple. A lot of people are making it really hard by going into the fuse box and looking for the windows and and they're like, oh, maybe my master switch is not working or something like that. It's not that hard. It really isn't. Uh, it's a simple wire. And it's in the same location, almost the same location, just within a distance of about this much between the Explorer, the utility, and the sedan, the Taurus. And it's literally the same wire with the same color. So what we're going to do is I'm going to actually show the wire, uh, explain what we could do. It's literally a plug that they cover. You're just gonna plug it back in and boom, the window works. Uh, and we're gonna see how, and I'm gonna explain the difference between the Taurus and Explorer. I'm actually gonna go to one of the Explorers we have here uh, and I'm gonna show where the wire is on the Explorer and where the wire is on the Taurus. So stay with me and I'll do it right now. Okay guys, so the first thing you're gonna do is actually, I, take, I usually take out the step over here, the driver's side step. You're gonna find the plug is just right here. Purple and white, just sitting right there. And the other side of the plug, right here. You're gonna simply just take the plastic uh, connector thingy, that's what I usually call it, um, right off. Take it off from both sides. Connect this. Just like that. There you go, we have a plug. Make sure that your connect over here, your, your master switch is not enabled, because if it's enabled, it's definitely not gonna work. I'm gonna go to the back. Uh, I'm gonna go. Okay, I'm gonna go down. And there you have it, the window's going down. So we have the plug that we just connected. Uh, I'm gonna go back to the door. We're gonna s just look at the window, make sure it's working. Down and up. Let's go to the other side. Make sure that it's working. And we have both sides that are working. So guys, there we have it. It's completely done. In our vehicle now, we have, if you're following every single step of the videos, we have key fobs, we have auxiliary audio, which is aux, uh, we have rear doors that are working and their switches are enabled, plugged in, simple plug and play, uh, usually go to a shop to charge you like six, seven hundred dollars, uh, with us here at Bayridge Motors, we ensure that it actually works. Uh, thank you guys so much. I really look forward to seeing you guys in the next video. Stay tuned for what we have next.